By the way, many people will be preparing a big turkey dinner tomorrow, and the Reno Fire Department is asking residents to be extra careful while doing so. More cooking fires happen on Thanksgiving than any other day of the year. Paul Nelson joins us live at Reno Fire Station 21 with some do's and don'ts when you're in the kitchen. So, Paul, what are some of the biggest tips? Well, Landon, one of the first things you should do is make sure you've got a good up-to-date fire extinguisher just in case a fire does break out. House fires double on Thanksgiving Day, and almost three-quarters of those are cooking fires. That's why it's important to pay attention whether you're cooking inside or outside. This is the kind of thing that can happen when turkey fryers are misused. The fire will, will flash a lot of times, it will get big, it'll spread. Officials say these are the most common Thanksgiving fires. If you use a fryer, you're encouraged to follow the manufacturer's instructions, make sure the turkey is thawed, and don't use too much oil, and keep it at least 10 feet from your house. You don't really want to use them in the house or on a combustible deck or balcony if you can, because if you get that spillover, you get that boil over, then you have the potential with the wood right there to cause a fire. Home fire danger is 2.1 times higher on Thanksgiving, when 72% of them are caused by cooking. Families are visiting, they're, you know, they may leave the room to go visit with their family members and leave the food unattended. That would probably be the most likely cause is unattended cooking. Use a fire extinguisher to put out a grease fire or put baking soda on it. You can also use the pan's lid if you have to. Slide the lid, don't do this, slide the lid over. And that will suffocate the fire and put the fire out. Whoever's cooking should use pot holders or oven mitts and avoid wearing loose, long sleeves. Don't leave pans like this where kids can run up and grab them. In fact, children should be kept out of the kitchen if possible. There's a lot of potential hazards for them in there. There's, there's hot water being boiled. There's the oven's on, the stove's on. There's a lot of potential for, for them to get injured. All tips that can help you have a happy Thanksgiving. Enjoy your family, enjoy your friends, enjoy the cooking. Just pay attention and be aware and be safe. And firefighters say even if you have a small stove fire and you're able to put it out, it's still a good idea to call the fire department. They've had cases where residents thought they had the fire out, but actually it got into the walls and spread up to the attic. Covering the story, Paul Nelson, Channel 2 News.